This is Bo. Bo has epilepsy with grand mal seizures. His epilepsy started when he was about five years old and now he's seven, so he's had it for about two years and he's been um, very difficult to control with medicine. Um, when he does have seizures, they're grand mal, which means he usually flips over, looks like he's running in place, thumbs excessively in the mouth and flips. If you want to see a dog having a seizure, there's a lot on um, YouTube and I suggest you take a look if you've never seen a dog have a seizure. This video um, we wanted to create to show you a technique for stopping a dog who is about to have a seizure or who is in the middle of a seizure. It works for my dog. I don't know if it would work for anybody else's dog, but I thought it would be good for people to know. Um, I've done this um, in um, various times and places. I've had um, my pet sitters do it when Boa has had a seizure and I've done it in front of vets. Um, what I do, and I guess the way it started was Bo started having cluster seizures and I just got really upset and I grabbed him in a beer hug and I said, Bo, stay with me, stay with me, and he stopped having his seizure. And what I think, um, so I've tried that every time he's had a seizure and it always works. If he's about to have a seizure, it stops it even if he's in the middle of a grand mal seizure. And it seems like there's three components. The first is a bear hug. And this is important because sometimes they could bite you, um, their legs are moving so they can scratch you. So I give him a bear hug, I rub him vigorously, and I tell him, Bo, stay with me, stay with me. Um, stay with me is actually also a command that I use. Instead of saying come or heal, uh, my command is stay with me. And so I don't know what part of this is working or whether all of it just works together. It may be by giving him a command, it's redirecting his brain waves and that's stopping the seizure. Um, it could be the bear hug, it could be the vigorous rubbing, it could be all of it. But again, what I do is I grab him like this, keep the the sharp claws and the teeth away, I rub him vigorously and I give him a command. And it works every time. Um, it doesn't keep him from having seizures and so he has to continue being on the medication, but it does stop the seizure and um, dogs who have epilepsy, once they have one seizure, they're more likely to have more seizures and have clusters. So it does stop the clusters.